Aqui Poo. Welcome to Tea Priestess. I hope y'all are doing lovely, feeling amazing. Um, this is a monthly reading, okay? I haven't done one for y'all yet. It's been a while, okay? So, let's see what comes out. Okay, let's see what comes out. I think that there's gonna be some Hold on. Some tea spilled. Spilling of the tea. Because y'all above this shit. Okay? So let's see. Alright. Week one. Okay, hold up, hold up. This is going to cover the end of July the end of July, something like that, maybe a recap of July, and then one-on-one, a recap of July. It's gonna bring it all together with the one-on-one, okay? So this is week one, sorry, <laughs> week four of July, okay? And then we're going into August. Okay, so do you wanna be happy? Y'all get the first August, okay? Uh, so one, two, three, come on now. It's for a reason. Okay, so week one, or sorry, week four of July is, do you want to be happy? I think that you're getting a lot of things this month, throughout the month of July. Uh, it's been leading up to you ultimately getting what you need and deserve to be happy, okay? Look up, what's up there, okay? That's week two, sorry, <laughs> week one of August, okay? Look up what's up there. I don't know, let's see. Okay, look, week two of August, everything happens for a reason. Okay, and then week three, many ways to play, okay? I feel like it's gonna be like on some, I don't know, I'm getting like incognito type shit week three of August, okay? And then week four, that's it, okay? By the end of August, it's gonna be like, that's it, that's it. I feel like whatever is supposed to be done is done by the end of August, okay? Keep moving forward for the whole month, that's what it looked like. And then the love is all real. So whatever love you getting, whatever is coming out, it's gonna be like, that is what you deserve, okay? All right, now let's go by week four of July. Do you wanna be happy? So right now, it's still the end of July, okay? So let's see what's coming out for now, okay? Ooh, okay, this card is a seven steps to an accurate and insightful tarot reading. Okay, I feel like you're getting a lot of insight. Also, you're creating a sacred space for yourself, making sure that you're safe, okay? Choosing, making choices for yourself, okay? And interpreting whatever is happening, like whatever's going on, you're interpreting. I feel like you're interpreting whatever's going on correctly, okay? And you're getting answers and reflecting so that way, or making people reflect so that, so that they can take answers. Sorry, so that they can take action, okay? And then look justice come on now so they can take action justice and you getting your justice you're getting justice in okay you're getting justice in the week four <laughs> okay i don't know why i'm so confused on the week four but four of pinnacles just came out okay again protecting yourself making sure that you're good and because you're making sure that you're good that's why people are i feel like they're doing things for you four five five come on now three of cups okay 
and you also get to celebrate. Celebrate, I feel, in a way where maybe you haven't been able to celebrate before, okay? I feel like there's things going on behind the scenes that you don't know about, but it's on some good levels. And you might get some surprises. You probably have already gotten some surprises this week. But it's like, you're going to be getting some more surprises, okay? Look, a U cards, a Aquarius card, Six of Swords, okay? And it's like, you're going to see how you're being prepared to leave, okay? The moving has been coming through on some readings, okay? I feel like the Aquarius reading that I did yesterday came out as like, you could be moving. I can't remember that reading. But 555, five, five, you could definitely be moving, be talking about moving, be preparing for moving, uh, be being prepared to leave a situation that you've been in. Also, you're seeing how situations are by the end of the month would have ended in a way where it all comes together for you. Look, four of wands, you getting what you deserve. And I feel like that's on some surprise level shit. Okay, you could be celebrating like going to a hotel. <clears throat> okay, that could be a surprise. Okay, <laughs> celebrating in a hotel, being in a hotel, something like that. Going somewhere where you don't normally live or whatever uh, and celebrating, having a celebration. Okay, judgment because of judgment. Like you have made people think and reflect and now they're taking action, okay? Page of Wands, okay, on the back overall. And this is some shit that is coming your way because you deserve this shit and it's needed. Six of Pentacles and that's why you getting what you deserve. Come on now, 7-Eleven, 713, H-Town, let's go. Okay, so that's week four. If anything needs to come out more for week... Oh, hold on. Week four. I'm going to pull some of these cards. Two. It's 12.55 right now. There's some changes going on. Okay. This is streaming uphill. Yep. You've been like going, going, going. And it's like maybe it has seemed like for week four. Like maybe it started off as like... Okay, I'm going, 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 going. And maybe nothing at first was happening. Okay, this is going back to like overall of July, okay? So maybe we're finish, finishing off July before we enter into August talk, okay? <laughs> enter into the August talk, okay? So you've been streaming uphill. And even though it maybe has felt like it was hard or whatever, you were still doing it, okay? You were still doing it and doing it in a way where it's like, you getting through that shit, okay? Making shit happen, doing the shit that you need to do for yourself, okay? Like a diamond, come on now. Out here shining bright and shining exactly like as you need to, okay? High, you out here, okay, you could be getting high, you know, or have gotten high, found like weed <laughs> i'm getting something like that you could have found weed throughout the month or whatever i really only talk about weed so if you get high on anything else i don't talk about nothing else but weed okay so you could if i say hi just in case because you know you could be a new person coming to watch or whatever coming through thank you for coming through oh wait <laughs> okay but i only talk about weed i don't do any other drugs or drugs period anything that is not uh fucking from god like we i don't talk about or i don't do and i don't refer to those things okay there's a gemini reading that i did in december uh that talks about how god can encourage you and also limit you but encourage you if you need to to like do certain things like uh, smoking weed because it has bigger purposes than just the smoking and just getting high because within the body within the mind it can um, 
protect you in in a lot of ways because it's a mixture of burning of the earth as well as fire and so according to like people who do like <laughs> like uh you know magic or whatever i don't do that over here we don't do that over here okay i don't talk about that unless it's like coming through because people are sending that shit but it can help to protect you against shit like that okay if people are sending that shit i'm a person where people have sent me a decent amount of like fucking black magic like since birth or whatever <laughs> basically but more so a lot like i've been battling a few different things out here okay but it's like uh fighting off black magic is has been more important as far as smoking within the last two years for me okay okay and also this could be a mixture of you know it depends on how you smoke it because i don't do cigarettes however most recently within the last two weeks i have 11 11 started to smoke black and milds i started or had my first black and mild with one of my cousins in 2018 and i hadn't done like smoked any black and mild since like since 2018 but just in 2022 uh like two weeks ago it came up to where it's like I was thinking about it, craving it in a way. And so I know that that's something that God was urging me to do because of things that were going on spiritually. Okay. So it's not something that you would just, it's like an, an idea, a feeling, uh, you know, like I said, I was craving it or whatever. That's how God can introduce shit like that to you. Okay. And will. Okay. And so, yeah. So you're out here like a diamond. Oh, well, I'll leave it there. So no is a confirmation. Or maybe throughout the month of July, you got some no's, okay? You got some no's. Or you got some no's. Maybe you told people no's, but maybe you got some no's. And those no's also gave you confirmation on what was going on or what could have been going on within your life or around that no whoever gave you the no it gave confirmation to like oh they really be on that shit <laughs> oh they really be doing that shit oh uh, because it's like if you say no or you or like no could mean like no acknowledgement either okay because if you acknowledge it then in a way that's giving a yes because it's like yes i did that yes you know i said that yes whatever but if they say if they say no or they don't acknowledge in any way then that's a no and so that's a confirmation for you so i feel like you've been getting it's one-on-one some confirmations okay through people telling you no's and also whatever no's that you got previously maybe those no's are turning into yeses and becoming confirmations and so why though could be like why did you do that shit or why why did you do that shit you know something like that okay now look i said you were shining come on now you shining out here by the end of the month of july you really gonna see how you shining and then pass along okay i feel like you could have been getting a lot of information that you've been passing on either to people in some way having conversations things like that okay yeah something like that you could also get some confirmation okay because this came out in some reading where it's like um maybe people thought or a person people or a person a company somebody thought that you were like just a pass along like like oh no we don't have to deal with them anymore like they use you for one one thing or whatever and literally okay i'm just looking at myself i feel like i'm really shining and i love it okay 
<laughs> I just needed to point that out real quick. But it's like, <laughs> it's like people could have really been like passing you along. Like being like, oh no, we don't have to deal with that. Oh no, we don't have to deal with Aquipu. Like, Aquipu think that we fuck with them like that? No. Something like that. I don't know. But it's like, it's like they're seeing that you're not a pass along. Like, you don't, you come back. <laughs> like, you come back and you also, like, I don't know, you come back. Like, you come back and you're not a person that just passes along. Like, like you don't just pass along. Like, you, you be out here, like, uh, making sure that you're seen like I'm doing right now. Okay? Something like that. Seen, heard, all of that shit. Okay? I just saw another 555. Five, five. You make sure that that's it for yourself. Like, you don't be like, look, no, no, no. You're not going to pass me along. No. It's just, no. And that's why it's like, do you want to be happy for the overall of July? Because you're seeing how 611, you're seeing how you get your love. And you're also leading to new beginnings that you weren't, maybe at the beginning of the month, you weren't even thinking about. But you got the help throughout the month from the divine. 629, come on now, on God. To be like, uh, like, let's do this. Let's not do that. Uh, think about this. Make them think about that. You know, make them do this. <laughs> Something like that. Okay? And that's why it's like, how do we start over? Because all them people who was like, no, they just to pass along. No, we don't have to deal with them. Um they're out here like now seeing the real real of you aquipu and it's like no you can't just pass me along okay so week two is look up what's up there sorry week one of august 713 h town okay week one of august is look up what's up there i'm getting something like you could have surprised or sorry we're going into august you could surprise somebody I don't know strength okay with your strength with the amount of strength that you have okay the death card and you getting two big ass cards in the month the first the beginning of august okay and it's like strength and a change a big change is happening week one okay the magician another big ass card and it's like it's like whatever this big ass change is, you would have did that shit. Mm hmm You did that shit. Like, you gonna see how it's like, hell yeah, I did that shit. Queen of Swords, like you said what you said. You said what you said. And then because you said what you said, it's like 1818. 18, the divine is like, hell yeah, you said that shit. Two of Swords. And even if you didn't or don't quite understand or know throughout week one, like, uh, fully what could be going on, you actually do. Because it's like you see the big shit. I mean, cause you, Aquipu, know, you know, could have some understanding about like future shit or whatever. And so it's like, you might not know like you might not see it what's going on but you also you also do know because it's like you're feeling your intuition your understanding and your knowing you could have a decent amount of Libra in your chart Leo some Scorpio and Aries okay I needed to look at the cards real quick again to see because you could also have with the strength Leo card you could have cancer you could have Capricorn you can have Sagittarius no 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 sorry not Sagittarius you could have Virgo and Pisces in your chart okay you could be in week one getting 
I want to say tempted or somebody could be trying to tempt you to do some shit that may be fun and good, but they could be a person who you shouldn't be doing it with, like having sex or something. It could be the wrong person, okay? I just saw 211. Could be the wrong person. Uh, the wrong person could be trying to come around you. Something like that. Trying to tempt you. Because you're the golden child, okay? The Hierophant, okay? So listen, it's like the divine is making sure that you're good, though, overall, for the whole first coming into August king of wands okay yep for sure because you have an understanding about who you are what you do out here and you express that shit you express that shit heavily i feel like you're going to be expressing in a way with the queen of swords like expressing a lot about who you are what you do out here could be advertising yourself you know plugging yourself things like that um and these could be ideas that you get from the divine to be like oh yeah do that oh yeah say that you know all that eight of cups okay and it's like you leaving you're preparing to leave remember in week four of july uh you're preparing to leave or something and i feel like eight of cups you get to do that shit i feel like maybe it took a while like took up until like maybe you started preparing week the week four like this week okay but then going into week one of august like you're still trying to make it happen or something but it's also like it is happening because you're showing your strength and you're making this change happen the the change also could greatly come throughout the first week so you could be moving within the first week, um, leaving whatever situation within the first week, making, okay, other people could be leaving or whatever within the first week also. I just, it's really fine, but I just always notice this right here, okay? One thing, I'm gonna just throw this in real quick. It might make sense if not, it's just me talking personally, but like I used to, I have, you know big cheeks or whatever you know it's always been something but it's like i've been uh you know a bigger person than what i am now and so i always now notice how it's i've always had these like i was born with that shit i don't mind that but this right here up in here like my laugh lines or whatever you know it's like i notice them a lot more because you know my cheeks are smaller my face is smaller and so, I don't know, something like that. Maybe you could be noticing things about yourself where it's like, oh, wow, that's a change. And you're adjusting, that's a card, adjusting to the adjustment of, like, what your body looks like, like, uh, things like that. And so, it's like, oh, wow, that's, that's what I look like now, you know, something like that. But that could also be on other levels outside of just appearance wise it's right now in the 23rd minute so on some goat shit okay libra shit but also goat shit libra shit you already say it could have libra in your chart um you're seeing how this shit is coming together okay i don't know something like that like how you're adjusting to the adjustment of yeah, week one. Whatever is coming together with a big change, with all of these big things, it's like that you made happen, okay? It's like you're adjusting to that. Like, oh, wow, I did that. Oh, wow. Like, hell yeah, you did that shit. And so it's like you put a lot of might into that, into uh, leaving the situation, getting out, making a change, okay? And then overall, look, going to the top. Wow, that could be a change. So you could be going up in positions, being seen more. I said you were, you are going to be like advertising yourself or whatever. And so you can also be seeing how, because you do all that, you did all that, but do all of that, 
do all of that that's like it's like look up look up what's up there you aquipo like you gonna be hot in a higher position and a higher like could you know subscribers wise or whatever be in a higher position higher numbers higher a whole bunch of things okay and in a way where it's like oh wow i did that you did that aquipo okay so you gonna see that um I'll come back. Hold on. I have to go get my food. <laughs> okay. So, week two of August is everything happens for a reason. Okay. And so, week two of August where everything is happening for a reason, I feel like you're really going to see how from July to the August point, I just saw 23 again. From July to the point in August where you will be week two you're really going to see how everything came back together and I said that at the beginning like 101 okay you really gonna see how everything came back together and is coming together okay Knight of Wands faux faux look you riding on foes come on now you riding on foes overcoming evil shit dark shit Oh, yeah, you really about to see how you have done that, Aquipu. Look, three of wands. This is some shit that, uh, look, I'm getting hype, <laughs> okay? Because you really about to see how the shit that you knew, excuse me, mm -hmm, the shit, look, God is coming through. 11, 1, 1, sorry, 1, 1, 1, okay? It's like, you really about to see how the shit that you knew, the shit that you understood, that shit is coming through in week two of August, okay? Some big shit, some, look, the Hierophant, come on now, some big shit, the shit that you is like, like right now, you could be, whenever you're watching or whatever, depending on when you're watching, but the end of July, okay? Like right now for me, I'm like, okay, God, when this shit gonna happen? <laughs> One fo fo, okay? When this shit gonna happen? When am I gonna get like this big confirmation? Week two of August, okay? Look, ten of cups and you about to be like one five five. Look, the change is happening, the big shit is happening, and it's like big shit for you though, but also big shit in a way that could be for other people, the other people or other people, other situations who were involved that have to give you shit that have to acknowledge shit, that have to tell you shit, that have to come to you like a man. <laughs> okay? Two, two, two. <laughs> Where they have to come to you like a man, okay? Stand the fuck up. Look, in the book of Job, God made Job stand the fuck up. God made Job and Job's friend be like, stand the fuck up when you talking to me. Okay, ho? <laughs> All right, look, God did that. And it was God. God did that. God was like, stand the fuck up when you talking to me. Like, be a man. But, like, not even just be a man. In the Bible, it'd it be talking about be a man and stuff. But it's like, be an adult type shit, okay? Be an adult, okay, out here. Like, stop being on that childish shit. I ain't got time for that childish shit. Look, God was on. <laughs> Look, in the book of Job, God be mobbing on niggas, okay, for real. Like, in that part. In that part of the Job book or whatever, it's like God came through and it's like, look, I'm here, hoes. What's up? And I'm making you stand up and be an adult. So when you talk to me, acknowledge me like you an adult. <laughs> I'm so serious. If you read it or listen to it or whatever, you'll see it. I don't know. But it's that part cool to me because it's like, hell yeah. Yeah, God, do that. <laughs> Two of cups, okay? Because it's like they deserve you deserve what you deserve and so look shooting threes and riding on foes okay i always do that wrong every time <laughs> that's a song if you have not heard that shooting threes and riding on foes okay that's where it comes from but it's like threes are like you shooting threes like if you talking about some you know a uh, basketball or something you know you standing at a line at a part of somewhere and you literally shooting and you you making it you're making the shots every time okay 
and you know because threes are like hard they can be very hard like people who make threes like it's like they had to practice they had to work they had to like really like learn how to shoot threes like it might have came naturally so you might have be able to shoot natural threes okay however it's like there's been some points where it's like you had to practice and work and make sure you can get them threes because some of them at one time were missed okay or people wanted you to miss them people wanted you to miss them they wanted you to miss the threes but look you shooting threes and riding on fours fours is like uh the shit that like talking about black magic and and whatever the fuck that people be sending your way bad thoughts all that shit like horrible shit that god, only god would know but god can tell you or whatever like that people is like they over there hating on you <laughs> they over there planning some horrible shit for you you know all of that it's like that's where you riding on foes because it's like they down there and you just riding just riding that's why it's like knight of wands riding on foes okay and so three of pentacles look you shooting threes out here you gonna be shooting threes and you gonna see how you really shot you shot all them threes and it was like hell yeah each one in 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 come on now you doing it aquipu five of pentacles and look it's making people have to leave some situations uh one to one look they lost but you won aquipu okay and then there's a reading that i did where it's like leo you won <laughs> leo you won and it's like you know leos have one because it's leo energy leo season leo energy okay because right now leo is in sun and also the fucking uh mercury and so leos are winning because the way that everything looks it's like leo energy and so through leo energy in the leo season leos are winning however you get some help aquipu because of leo season because leo is the opposite of you okay yes that's all page of pentacles look surprise you about to get some surprises people about to get some surprises but you about to get some surprises in this in week what's that two of august it's about to be like hell yeah but you about to see everything happens for a fucking reason and it's like the reason you gonna find out the reason 7-eleven 713 h town is because the reason is because you out here shooting threes okay i feel like that came out look shooting threes three e's you shooting threes wow i just put that together like the whole e e e thing that i do because <laughs> i thought it was it was to like be petty okay it has been to be petty because you know me and gabby petty or whatever but it's also like because you shooting threes threes is being shot and so that explains the v or anything where i put e <laughs> I get it. Look, it be coming like Gabby like explaining things later. And so I really love that. But that's why because you shooting threes, you making people leave situations and things is changing out here on some big boom shit. Okay. Look, in the middle, six of swords or sorry, six of wands, you out here and people seeing you and it's like, yep, this is me. Hey. Okay, two of swords. And that came out again but it's like one two three right now uh you shooting threes <laughs> it's like no matter what the fuck it look like you're shooting threes somebody asked me on a youtube comment the other day like uh who is you <laughs> and i was like what the fuck my name look like <laughs> like what the fuck my name look like like you know you can click on my name and it can go to my channel right and then that's who the fuck i am like don't be coming at me like that because i ain't got time especially in the comment section like i i i can go there if anybody is watching and you want to ever like fucking come at me on some shit in comments oh no see you don't know me again i said me and god be petty yes god be telling me shit <laughs> 9 11 come on now me and god be petty on some shit like 
I will have you leave it. Like, I will make you not want to ever comment on my shit ever again. And I mean that. <laughs> I mean that. <laughs> People be having me fucked up. And so it's like, oh, you think you could do... Look, you ain't met me. You ain't met me. And so... You come at me, I'm going to come back at you 10 times harder because God can give me information about you. And I mean that. Like, I don't even need to know you. I don't need to know shit about you. But I can come. <laughs> I can bring up some shit. And you're going to be like, how the fuck she know that shit? Because of God. Yep. Again, petty. My petty is on 10 times harder. Like, you don't know my petty. <laughs> People, look, I make people never, ever, ever want to comment on my shit ever again. Never want to, if you don't, never watch me. But the thing is, I feel like they also be watching me after that because it's like, how the fuck she knew? <laughs> how the fuck did she, did she come to that consensus about me? God, ho, look, dead and gone for week two. <laughs> okay, look, it's just like what I said. It's like... You making people <laughs> be like, nope, that shit is dead and gone. Like, either they never want to fuck with you again, or it's like, it's like, uh, the situations are fully dead and fucking gone. And it's just like that. And then, look, they be like, what's up after that? Look, I feel like you be making people, like, fuck with you in a way where it's like, because, okay, so I was watching... Mero talk on um, Mad Hoffa, the like whatever that I don't know what the show is called, but where he's they talk in like the barbershop or whatever. And so I was watching that, and uh, Mero was talking about how he got jumped by Crips or whatever, and when he was a teacher, and <laughs> and he was whipping little, little niggas' asses, okay. And so it's like after that, they was like they wanted to fuck with him. <laughs> Like, they was like, look, you in the gang now. Like, <laughs> like what's up? You in the gang now. Like, we can't, we, we know we can't fuck with you. Like, <laughs> you beat our ass. <laughs> and he was taking them shits. Like, they was punching him and beating him up. But he was like, he was focusing on, he said he was focusing on one nigga. And because he was focusing on that one nigga, they all saw that shit. And he really beat his ass. And so because he really beat his ass, they was like, oh, no, nah, we can't fuck with him no more. <laughs> And he was a part of the gang. He was like gang gang on that, but not really. He was like, I don't even do that shit. Like, I'm not I'm not a part of no gang. I don't want to be a part of your gang. It's cool that we're cool now that y'all like see that, you know, I don't give no fucks out here or whatever, you know, but don't 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 add me to that shit. <laughs> okay? So it could be something like that where it's like people is like, you know, they on some what's up shit because you like you taught them some shit. You taught them some shit, okay? Out here like a diamond. Mm-hmm. You shining on them. <laughs> Look, because they thought you was a pass along. They thought that they could fuck with you like that and just pass along and just move along and be like, oh, no, we're going we gonna to jump them. we going to fuck with them. we going to whatever them. And then we just going to leave them. Like, leave them. And then that's it. No. That's not it. So... You got people out here fucking with you in a whole bunch of ways because they see you can't be fucked with. And you also a nigga that will, like, you want to fight? All right, let's go. <laughs> like, let's go. You want to be in the comments talking shit? All right, let's go. Like, what's up? Like, you got words. I got words, too. <laughs> Like, you got words, I got words too, okay? Look, I feel like August is about to be lit. Okay, let's see. Week three of August. Many ways to play, okay? Look, I feel like this comes in with now you got, you got niggas. Like, you got new niggas who, like, fuck with you. Like, they could still maybe be like, okay, they beat my ass or they, you know, talk to me like that. They did whatever, like, you did whatever, Akwipu, to them. But it's also, like, they fuck with you because of that shit. And so you have them now. Two of Cups, okay? They giving you love. They giving you love. Because it's, like, week three, they they seeing, like, okay, they cool. <laughs> they cool, basically, because of all that shit. They cool. Look, the tower. Come on now. The tower. 
okay so i feel like they you blew their fucking mind or are blowing their mind for real for real and we look ten of swords and that's why that shit is done and over with because of the way that you came at them the shit that you presented to them whatever the fuck go down it's like nah nigga you can't fuck with me and i mean that so stop fucking with me okay look you show that your strength you showing your strength and because you showing your strength it's like nope look like the movie nope i don't know i still haven't seen it but <laughs> that's how it's gonna come in i don't know two of pentacles okay making them think making them be like well i guess we should not fuck with them and like really like making it known like no you should not fuck with me and don't fuck like don't fuck with me ever again but also like you shouldn't have fucked with me you know queen of cups okay and it's like look now you get to be in a in different energy <laughs> like i did all that fighting shit over there okay i was in that whatever energy that took you to a place or whatever and now you're in loving energy they're loving you they are admiring you okay they are feeling you basically six of wands and that's why you out here like it's like because of the way that you came out or whatever you out here in the beginning of the month or whatever they like it's like people don't like that or they don't like that and it's like okay and so they gonna come at you in some ways and it's like okay <laughs> okay <laughs> just like that okay and so okay and so you showed them by week three you have showed them and that's why you can calm down because you don't have to be in the energy anymore because they wanted that shit for you and now you can go back to a loving energy be in a loving energy and you don't have to be on that shit look and that's why i already showed that but that's why you out here and making them stop that shit and leave that shit alone look you getting your justice come on now week three getting justice because it's like y'all made me do what y'all made me say what like you know i will go there right look you have to show them we'll be showing them look don't doubt it like don't doubt that i feel like don't doubt the shit that they saying to you or the shit that they're doing to you or whatever because it's like yeah they really doing that or they really said that or whatever or you you really have to be in this energy but it's also like it's forced because of whatever the fuck they did said you know took whatever action against you or whatever i don't know i feel like it's it's like on some shit it's on some shit it might not be like fully on some shit but it's on some type of shit but i also feel like it could be like how i'm describing it like that was just like mm, like what it looks like but it may not really be that like with the queen of cups it's like maybe you could really be one three three yeah it's like maybe you really could be in the energy of like look i can go there i can do this but i won't and they know that and that's why they're leaving you alone and they fucking with you because they learned already within like how you came into the month and so it's like i feel like honestly the what just happened in week three is like the other people's perspective and not necessarily yours because it's like they looking at you and they're yes with the six of wands they're looking at you and they like oh wow nah we fuck with them because they really like week one week two in july like really like battled us or whatever in whatever way that means for you like they really they really did that and so it's like nah we fuck with aquipu because of that you know like the marrow story um yeah and because you already went through that shit and so it's like week three is like them being like we fuck like them coming into the 
the terms of like we fuck with you something like that okay so that's it for week four and look by week four it's like they like really acknowledging that that's it and you seeing that that's it you moving on because that's it okay king of pentacles look you getting some money some big money okay you getting some big money out here in this hoe look ten of cups come on now coming out again you getting big money you're getting uh your life i want to say life back okay you going into new situations new living arrangements you could be getting a new car okay um by the end of august you could see that you have would have gotten a new car um like it's like everything everything you beat that shit you did that shit you won aqua poop come on now look <laughs> ace of pentacles come on now it's like this the end of the month is going to be lovely and i mean that because you shooting threes you on some goat shit okay people can't deny that you not the greatest of all time <laughs> okay look ten of swords because of the way that you handled that shit, it's like, it's like, nah, I could prove great. <laughs> like, they great as shit. Because they really, like, we threw all that shit at them. We just kept throwing and throwing and throwing and throwing. <laughs> and you beat that shit every time. You was like, nope, 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 fuck out of here, nope. Mm -mm. Five of Wands, you beat that shit. You won. You have, like... It's like, whatever you f you throw at me, I'm going to beat it. <laughs> you know? <laughs> like, what? The hangman. And that's why people is thinking differently about you. They really, like, throughout the whole month of August, it's like, 21, 21. Come on now. You was on some savage shit. You going to be on some savage shit. It's like, it's like, it's like, whatever. They really thinking about how you really fought them back. <laughs> you fought them back like you didn't just allow them to beat you the fuck up and be like oh yeah no oh my god i'm being taken down oh my <laughs> oh my god like what what do i do with this no you were like okay come at me bro what's good what's good and so <laughs> because of that it's like look four of pentacles you was protecting yourself you gonna see how you was protecting yourself real hard Okay, there's a hey Libra reading. That's also because I kept calling Libra Lily, which Lily is Leo and Libby is Libra. But I kept calling Li Libra Lily. And so it has a mi it's a mixture of Leo in there. But it's called Hey Libra. You're gonna see how protecting your what protecting yourself so hard did. And in that reading, it's like Libby was really protecting themselves, but it's because of this Leo energy. Look, that's why Leo's is winning. That's why the the Leo energy is making people win out here. It had to be this time. This is the perfect time for winning season. Okay, look, this is like the fucking um an NBA. Wait, hold up, like the champion championship season. This is it. Like, this is like, look, this, that's it. This is the championship in the 23rd minute. This is the championship season. And you going against all these other teams, okay? And each team you winning, 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 winning. <laughs> and you going to see by the end of August, you would have beat all them teams and you the fucking winner of the whole championship. You taking the, tr the trophy home like, hell yeah, I did that shit. What's up? what's up come on now look six of swords you making people leave from around you okay making people make people do shit like at the beginning you making people do shit out here reflecting so they could take action look just like that come on now ten of wands okay because you were put through the ringer they was out here fighting you sending all types of shit your way and it's like, no, hoes, leave me alone. Leave me alone. You could be getting some surprises or whatever by the end of the month, too. Also, 
because of all this shit like these people could be surprising you with okay i'm getting something about like mentions they could be advertising you playing like if you do music playing your music uh advertising you like being like hey look at this like telling they people to look at this telling a lot of people to look at this to look at you to admire you or whatever because they admire you now but i feel like because they was doing all this shit to you they also admire you okay even if they don't look at it like that they admire the fuck out of you to be able to make you protect yourself like that and that's why that's it you really gonna see by the end of fucking august <laughs> that's it it's just that's it and you would have did that shit okay i know me personally i feel like a lot of this black magic <laughs> black magic shit on me that people have been sitting on me or whatever the fuck people have done that i've been battling okay um that shit started like about around this time last year okay so for me it's been a whole year <laughs> a whole fucking year okay and so it's like you know i mean i picked up not not necessarily picked up on habits oh i didn't finish talking about the tobacco thing okay so like i don't know <laughs> i'll say it but you know like if you smoke a swisher sweet or whatever you know in houston we smoke swishers or whatever people do backwards or whatever too but the tobacco so one thing when i was living in dc this is what dc niggas do they smoke spliffs or whatever and spliffs have um uh, like tobacco and weed and so whenever i went up there i had this like uh he's from baltimore he's from baltimore this baltimore boyfriend or whatever that i met in san antonio and then when i went i basically ended up getting a job or whatever moving up to d the dmv or whatever and so i was a little closer to him for a little while but then i broke up with him <laughs> i broke up with him <laughs> And then, okay, the thing is, look, after I broke up with him, my life, like, I got two jobs that, like, paid, okay? Like, I mean, paid a whole bunch of money. And so, like, it's like, you know, you could also be seeing how getting rid of people, <laughs> seriously, move, leaving situations, getting rid of people, like, your life just amplifies because they now gone. Like, they were the ones stopping you. Like, them being in your energy them having your time they were stopping you this whole time and you're really going to see that okay i feel like by the end of august you're really going to see that but also throughout the month okay you're going to see 713 h town you're going to see how people's energies them being in your energy not you taking on their energy but in a way you know y'all are exchanging energy in some way they were stopping you the whole fucking time because they energies is like not matching yours they're low vibrational you know they out here thinking all negative thoughts it's like you know negativity is like trying to keep you down or whatever you're gonna see how that shit was trying to keep you down whatever they shit is trying to keep you down and so yeah you're gonna see how as soon as you snip snip cut cut they gone gone <laughs> look dead and gone i didn't even notice this was here dead and gone as soon as they dead and gone it's like bye like life better on so many levels but it's like elevated more ev elevated because from july all the way up until the end of august your life is already you know moving up you moving on up <laughs> okay like you moving up and so because of all that it's like look you protected yourself hard as shit away from all this energy again like i said you know doing things like i burn incense i smoke whatever i smoke between weed and blacks now or okay like i was saying the tobacco okay like uh tobacco in the swisher sweets like i do smoke that <laughs> I do smoke that or I do like just smoke cigars like one day in the future. I really cannot wait to go. I've been having talks with God about and God knows I want to do this. But uh, like going to a cigar shop and like, you know, sitting in the cigar shop and I feel like they like drink whiskey or something with it or some type of dark liquor. 
but also with the cigars and they're sitting there enjoying the fucking cigars like i literally cannot wait until i do that <laughs> i can't wait because i don't know throughout this whole year i really have came to love cigar smoking i really do i don't know it's a thing and it's like you know in the future you know that's one thing that it's like that's why god controls or tries to help you control what you're doing because you know in the future you know it could have some type of effect on me but also you know god be healing and i mean that so it's like god throughout the time or whatever can also tell you ways in which to not take it so far to where you're fucking up your lungs you know you're doing things but it's like you could be doing things yes but tobacco is something that's natural it comes from the earth it grows it's a plant okay again i only talk about plants i only do plants i literally only do plants and so if it's a plant i also learn because the divine guided me to it you can smoke green tea okay you can smoke teas you can do a few different things look up for yourself again god is going to guide you if this is something that you need to do because it depends on like what people is like sending your way you know and three 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 look but you gonna shoot threes on them every time and this helps like uh burning shit burning shit burning shit mostly because usually it's like a lot of people do earth shit or something something like that like they be conjuring up the fucking earth <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what they do, but they be conjuring up the fucking earth. And like, like I heard, I was watching something and it's like, people can write your name on papers or shit and like bury your name. And so <laughs> that's like how they can stop you if you're buried, like bury your gifts, bury your talents, bury you. Okay. And it's like, what? Oh my God. That's a lot. And so, you know, you could be Maybe you could be getting insight on some people that have done things like that. <laughs> okay? Like, I'm a bury you. <laughs> oh, my God. And then, like, people can do stuff where it's like, God got to meet to this witch's woman video. Excuse me. That was a big one. That means God is like, look, <laughs> that's why it's going to stop. Okay? It's like, people have, like, they can freeze you. Like, they put, like your name in a jar or some shit and then like some water or some shit and then they like fucking like put intentions into it but they write your name or write whatever they want for you or some shit i don't know something like that and then they put it in the freezer and let it freeze and then that does something for you too <laughs> like what the fuck like y'all people really be going through a whole bunch of different levels like that's time and energy that you're really putting into stopping me you know that right i don't know even if it's like some because the witch woman she was doing it because she wanted somebody to leave her alone or something i don't have time for that like, I just be like, okay, God, I know you're going to handle it. <laughs> Look, God got it. That's why it's like, because God can fuck up somebody more than fucking magic. And I mean that. Like, your magic can fuck up somebody. Yes, because they be fucking up people with magic. But it's like, God created whatever the fuck y'all are doing, basically. Like, because that shit is in the dark. That's on some devil shit. That's devil shit. And so it's like, and that could be with words. Like, people be saying shit with their words. My, 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 my. <laughs> they be mouthing shit and shit. Like, I, no time for that. Look, Page of Cups, they gonna get some surprises, though. You gonna get some surprises about who these people are, what they've been doing. There could be some readings on, like, going deeper into what I'm talking about. Because I don't normally talk about this shit, but... I feel like that's coming through where I'm going to be doing some readings throughout August or something <laughs> to uncover this shit and basically put that shit out there and be like, yep, they doing magic. <laughs> they was saying that they buried you or whatever the fuck, you know, stupid shit. Mm -hmm. But you shooting threes and riding on foes. We're going to be shooting threes and riding on foes out here. And that's all that matters. Okay. So look the love is all real these people who are now loving you and because you know you shop you showed them you not know you not know hoe out here you not know hoe yeah 
I'm using it in that term. You not no hoe out here. And because you not no hoe out here, it's like, don't fuck with me. <laughs> don't fuck with me. And that's why you keep it moving forward. Just like that. <sighs> that's lovely. I love this reading. Look, I thank you. The divine is thanking you. And they on some get rich or die trying type shit. Like, that's what you're going to see. Like, it's like, they wanted to bury you. <laughs> it Look, it could be literal fucking bury, you know, like they wanted to kill you or whatever. Have you dead. But it's like, um, they wanted to stop you because they wanted to take from you. But also they wanted to like, I don't know. I feel like also they wanted to see how far you would go. Also at the same time, they want to see, wanted or will want to see how far you can go. And so because of that, it's like you show them, but you also, I feel like you show them in a different way. Like you just show them in a, in a whole different way. Like, yeah, I'll go there. But also in a whole different way. Like they're not expecting this shit. Like how I was like, I make people never want to fucking talk to me. <laughs> never want to fucking talk to me ever again because it's like you had me fucked up and i'm gonna really tell you about that shit and so they like literally most likely never want to fuck with me again or want to fuck with me in so many ways because it's like i was like you will never want to fuck with me ever again and so it's like this it's a challenge <laughs> like maybe it's like that like they're challenging themselves now because <laughs> it's like Oh, they made me not want to fuck with them that hard that I want to fuck with them? That's a challenge. I don't know. Something like that. I don't know. It's stupid. Whatever it is, it's it's all dumb. <laughs> it's all dumb. It's dumb. Okay? <sighs> That's it, though. I appreciate y'all for coming through. I really do. I thank you. Remember, nigga is for niggas, y'all. Okay? Go listen to that hoe. Go listen to, uh, I was about to say Blunt Talk Tape 8. Go listen to that. Maybe you need to listen to that. Because that's on some big boom shit. Eight is boom. Like, boom. It means big shit is happening on some eight shit. So, blunt talk tape eight could be very important. Go listen to that by Tay Caso. Okay? Um, also, you can't confuse me about me. My album. Also, and then <laughs> I just released an EP. The beats going hard. Look, all of this makes sense. So, it's like, let's go. Listen to all that or whatever, if you choose. It's on every music platform. You know you want right here on YouTube also, wherever, if you're watching this, well, it's on YouTube, okay? <laughs> it's on YouTube also, so, all right. Thank y'all. Remember, again, niggas for niggas. Really listen to that one. I, I really love that. That was fun. Okay, bye y'all. Hey. Take us on, baby.